Good morning. Welcome to our morning devotion. Glad you are tuned to the morning encounter. It is our prayer that you will encounter with God through this broadcast. And now, let's welcome the servant of God. Hallelujah. I'm excited today. Being a Sunday as we prepare to go to church. I'm just excited. We have been looking at the book of Romans chapter 12 and just giving us a summary of the entire chapter. And today, I just want to give some life application as you go to church in the name of the Lord because that is very, very important. Every child of God who is created in the image of God would want to receive everything God has planned for him. And I know this morning, you will really desire to receive everything your heavenly father has planned for you by becoming a Roman 12 Christian. If you want to get everything your father has planned for you, choose to be a Roman 12 Christian. And I challenge you, even as you go to church this morning, please read Romans chapter 12. That is the calling God is calling us to be. The second thing I want to tell you, you must personally take the step to be all in all in your relationship with Christ. You must take your personal initiative and say, I want to be this Roman 12 Christian. I want to have relationship with Christ. Because if you don't do that, you'll miss something as a child of God. And uh, there's a question you might be asking, and maybe you're looking for an answer. How can one surrender? How can one separate from the world's values? Those are questions that many people are asking. How can I surrender my life to God? and be separated from the world's value. I challenge is very simple. Just believe in Christ and choose to do the right thing. Because when you do that, God himself is going to bless you. Prepare to do the best in your life for God's sake. Because when you do that, God will also be happy with you. And another thing that we need to know as we pray together is that you need to ask yourself, what is the next step that will help me fulfill God's dream for my life? You have God's dream for your life, but you're asking yourself, what is the next, next step? I challenge you. If you're going to live and to fulfill God's dream in your life, the next step for your life is obedience. You must obey the word of God. You must obey the calling of God. You must obey the oracles of God. That is the only way you can experience the next step of your life. Maybe you're asking yourself, Pastor, how can I enter into my next step of fulfilling God's dream for my life? Just obey God. God is telling you this morning, my child, can you surrender to me? Can you give yourself to me? Can you identify the giftings I've given you today? And you just obey him. And as you obey him, I assure you without fear of any altar that God is going to bless you. God is going to uplift you. As you go to church, as you go to your ministry today, may you be an obedient servant of God and the Lord is going to bless you. I wish you well. From our altar here at Sita Meldoret, we wish you well wherever you are going. And may God bless you. May God keep you. And may God cause you to be an obedient Christian this morning in Jesus' name. Let's pray together in the name of our Lord. Our heavenly Father, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we choose to be obedient this morning. We choose to obey with our substance. We choose to obey with our time, with our talent and treasures, O oh God. And I pray for my listeners as they prepare to go to their different fellowships. May your grace be sufficient to their lives. I thank you and I worship you. In Jesus' name I pray and the people say, Amen and Amen. God bless you. Have a blessed Sunday. 
Let's meet again next week as we interact with the Word of God. Shalom, 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 and pass our greetings to wherever you're going to, to church this Sunday. That was the morning encounter. We are glad that you tuned in. Follow us on YouTube at Sidim Eldoret TV. Our Facebook page is Sidim Eldoret. Our Twitter and Instagram handles at Sidim Eldoret. And our website is eldoret.sidim.org. Let's encounter again tomorrow morning, same time, same place.